What is going on, everybody on YouTube? Steve here with Rake and Profit over at rakeandprofit.com. Coming back to you with another video. And today has been a very, I don't know how to describe it, a disappointing or an interesting day for Amazon sellers. And the reason is, is because today, two very big brands that I know a lot of us Amazon sellers are selling on the Amazon platform have now become restricted. And, uh, you know, once in a while when you know, a brand restricts some of the products, you know, it might, it might just be for new items or maybe, for example, Under Armour, they restrict a lot of their current items from, you know, the year that we're in, but you could usually sell, you know, older items and whatnot. That's kind of what happens from my experience when brands start to restrict items off. But today was a very interesting day because two very large brands, Sony and Nikon, actually restricted off pretty much everything that is being sold on the Amazon platform. I'm talking about new stuff. I'm talking about used stuff. I mean, the whole nine yards, which is really crazy. So I want to update you guys and let you know what is going on. If you guys do a simple search on your phone, if you download the Amazon seller app and you start to look up these items, again, look up new items under the Sony and Nikon brand. Look up used items. Pretty much every single item is coming up as restricted which is definitely a big disappointment because I know a lot of us folks sell a ton of items you know from these brands on Amazon I know I find a lot of Sony stuff you know new in the box from pawn shops thrift stores and I, I make a decent amount of money per year especially with Sony and this is what worries me guys this is a another reason why I want to make this video not only to update you with what's going on but to kind of let you know that I've had this feeling for a while that this was going to happen not specifically with Sony, but I had a feeling for the longest time that these big brands are going to start restricting off these items to really control their marketplace and control the flow of their products and whatnot. And it's starting to happen, guys. More and more brands are starting to restrict off their products. And what they're they're wanting you to do is to get approved, right, to either go through a wholesaler or to get invoices. I'm not exactly sure of the process. And um, I'm actually uh, reading some of these posts on the Amazon seller forum. But people are not happy about this. And you just have to be aware that this is going to probably Probably be an ongoing trend more and more big brands and I've been talking to a lot of the guys behind the scenes in the green room and whatnot and a lot of the folks think that these big brands like Microsoft Apple Canon I mean the list goes on and on they're probably going to become restricted eventually so if you're a seller on Amazon what I would suggest to you is to get very creative think of ways possibly that you can become approved that's what I'm gonna do I don't know if that's gonna be opening up a brick-and-mortar store or making wholesale connects I don't know what that is but I definitely have a feeling that you know over the next upcoming months and years this is probably going to happen with more and more brands and what's that gonna mean for you pretty much it's gonna mean that you're not gonna be able to sell a lot of these big brand named items if you aren't approved so I'm not sure exactly what's gonna happen guys but definitely a little bit of a disappointing day for us uh, resellers out there on Amazon as now it seems that all the items that are Nikon branded and Sony are restricted new and used uh, one thing I do want to say and I want to give a big shout out to uh, the thrift coach on YouTube I was talking to Rob behind the scenes he said that he did get in contact with one of the Amazon representatives and they did say that if you do have inventory right now in the Amazon warehouses, so for example, let's say you have you know, some Sony micro cassettes or you have a Nikon camera lens, let's just say you have product in the warehouse right now within these brands, according to this woman, you're going to still be able to continue to sell these items and keep them in your inventory. So I'm not exactly sure how true that is, but that's what I heard and uh, fingers crossed that we're allowed to sell off uh, some of these items and whatnot. But anyways, guys, just want to come to you guys with this video. Let me know what you think about the latest news of Sony and Nikon restricting off their items. Leave a comment below. Curious to hear what you think, but until next time, see you in the next video. Keep on picking and making that money and I'll see you guys soon. Bye.